Anyhow, Mount, Mount Gambier was a very um, small town, you know, way out from um, the big city areas. And he had a very busy practice. And um, then the Second World War came along, and of course, he went right back in, and he was a colonel for this, at this stage. And he was in charge of um, the main big rehabilitation hospital, which was up in Darwin, south of Darwin, somewhere in, you know, in central Australia, and where all the wounded came down from the um, from the New Guinea uh, theatre of, of war. So he had a big, big job during the Second World War, and came back and went back into practice again, and. Um, so I don't know. That's um, about all I want to, could say about. It. He had a he had a wonderful um, vacation cottage down on the on the on the on the ocean front, which was some miles from Mount Gambia. But it was a deserted, wild place, you know, roaring surf and just miles of empty beach. And my brother and I had some big, pretty big adventures there. <laughs> I bet. Yeah, we got lost and. Oh, all sorts you of things. You went therapy. up over the dunes, didn't you? you we did, and you yeah. We came out. To get and, back. Well, no, you look <laughs> up and down the beach, and there's just miles and miles of sand and dunes, and, and you know, we didn't know where we were coming from. Now, what's the name of the speech? Do you remember? No? Um, no, I, I'm not sure there was a name. You know, it was just way out there. Uh huh. And uh, a lot of um, wild Hereford ca cattle, I remember that. And then when we didn't show up back at the cottage, and he came out from town to see how we were doing, because he left us there by ourselves, so it was rather a bold thing to do. And couldn't find us, you know, and he thought at least we'd been trampled to death by cattle, you know. Mm -hmm. And we took the boat out, and we got caught in the tide and swept out towards <laughs> the ocean. I always remember that. And um, Uncle Norman came out and had a speedboat too, a big speedboat. <laughs> he came came out in the speedboat, and and uh, I could see him charging down. I guess the, 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 with the current, you know, but we're all going down the river. And uh, he he reached out to get the rope off the boat. You know, his fat hat, his favorite hat, <laughs> went in the water. He just like, oh my God, he said. Your mother's not going to believe this. <laughs> Anyhow, he never invited us back after that. <laughs> never did. Mm -hmm. and the other thing, I, I've told you this, but, you know, it was a very, very fancy way of living. They, you know, they, they lived well. They had the whole staff looking after the house and everything. And breakfast was a, you come into the big dining room and there's a big sideboard and there'd be scrambled eggs and there'd be ham and there'd be this and that, you know, you just go along and you, in, all in silver, you know. Well, Serving things. So, yes, with little heating bowls underneath and so mm -hmm. on, the real thing. And uh, so we'd sit down and have breakfast and um, of course we, didn't, we wouldn't see him again until supper time, but, but um, <laughs> one time I, he, he made he he had a good sense of humor, a real dry sense of humor. He was so sarcastic too, and he made some kind of remark, and, and Bob just ha 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 laughed, you know, and had a mouthful of food, and just sprayed Uncle Alvin with food, and, and uh, every time after that, when uh, Uncle Norman would make a joke, he'd get his napkin up and he'd, he'd get behind it like this. <laughs> Waiting for Bob to laugh. So. Oh well, anyhow, there's so much about Uncle Norman. Came over here to see us all mm -hmm. once, and Wendy was um, his pen pal. Mm -hmm. He had a, a special affection for Wendy. And when he died, he left Wendy all his battle ribbons, mm -hmm. all his medals. Did you ever save his letter about the fishing? He sent you a letter, and, and he had a picture. He drawn a picture of himself in the boat, you know. Mm -hmm. And then there's the thing going down mm -hmm. the line, and the worm on the end of it, and the fish are just laying back on their backs, laughing. 
<laughs> <laughs> Don't remember that. <laughs> mm -hmm.